Hi everybody, how are you guys? Today I am a vampire. Um, I wanted to do something different. I wanted to do like a cl like a romantic vampire, and not like a classic, you know, with the smoky eyes and uh, you know a lot of darkness on the eye. Uh, I wanted to do something different, and uh, this is my look. Um, I hope you guys like it. It's really pretty, as you can see. It has like a reddish and a bronzy colors and it's very very beautiful I love it so if you want to see how I did this please keep watching okay everybody we're gonna start with a violet base on the eyelid um, but I'm gonna be using this gel liner from Physicians Formula cause this is the right color that I'm looking for so we're going to be using the Metal Mania palette from Coastal Sense and the first color that we're going to be using is going to be this rusty kind of bronzy uh, red. Uh, we're going to apply it on the eyelid and then we're going to apply the edges with a fluffy brush because we don't want to have like harsh lines out uh, the outer parts of the eye. Okay, so the next color that we're going to be using is going to be kind of a taupey uh, tone. We're going to apply it exactly on the crease area and then uh, we're going to blend it inwards. Now it's time to apply the uh, black liner. We're going to apply loads and loads of black liner on the upper, lower and also at the um, waterline of the eye. Now don't worry if it's not perfect because then you're going to smudge it with a pencil brush. Okay, so let's move on to the face area. Make sure to apply like a foundation that it's one or two coats lighter than your actual skin tone. And make sure to use like a stiff brush to apply it because you want to have like perfect skin. So it's best if you use a good foundation. Now as you can see, I'm going to be using this mini kit that I got from Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics because they have this airbrush foundation that is so liquid and so beautiful and I'm gonna be using it to contour my cheeks you know because vampires have like that this perfect perfect bone structure and that's what I'm looking for so this is gonna help me to contour the cheeks in a perfect way if you don't have like a liquid foundation or if you don't have like a creamy foundation you can use powder but I think that when you use liquid products uh, the makeup looks uh, more natural so if you're using these products make sure to use your fingers because that way you're going to uh, blend even better the foundation uh, on your skin Urgh, i'm gonna suck your blood <laughs> okay everybody so now it's time to apply the same rusty tone that we applied uh, previously this time we're going to apply it on the lower part of the eye because this is going to help us to blend the black liner that we uh, applied previously. Now it's time to highlight and I'm going to be using this beautiful color that is actually a mixture between a pinky and a vanilla tone. So if you have something similar, please use it because it's going to look uh, much, much better. It's going to look pretty and sensual at the same time. Now don't forget to blend between the colors because you don't want to have harsh lines and it's very very important to blend the colors. So you're going to have like a, a runny um, makeup. It's going to look very seductive and it's going to look very pretty. Okay, now we're going to be doing the brows. I'm going to try to do a strong brow because you know I want to have like a good frame for my eyes and that's why I decided to use like a medium tone um, pencil. Now I recommend you not to use a black pencil because that way you're going to get, um, you're going to look older and you want to have like a, this innocence, this uh, youth that vampires uh, have. So try to use like a good medium tone uh, color and then just do your brows the way you uh, usually do. As you can see I'm just blending the pencil that I use with a angled brush just like that and there you go perfect brows. 
Now I'm going to be using just a tiny bit of this eyeshadow because I want to clean the under uh, brow area and this is going to help me to do that. Also it's going to help the light catch and it's, my eyes are going to look really really bigger and beautiful. So now it's time to um, create the outer V shape at the outer corner because that way we're going to get dramatic eyes and it's going to make your eyes look very seductive. So make sure to use that V shape with a small brush. It's best if you use like a pencil brush and uh, make sure to blend it inwards so that way the eyeshadow is going to get um, mixed between the rusty color that you used previously. So I think I need just a tiny bit of a reddish coppery color and that's why I'm going to be using this uh, pigment from NYX. As you can see I'm just applying the eyeshadow or the pigment at the inner corner of my eyes. As you can see it looks very reddish but it's very pretty you guys and this will complement the colors that you have on your eyes beautifully. Now don't forget to curl your lashes and apply mascara. The more coats of mascara you apply, the more longer, beautiful uh, your lashes are going to be. But if you are just lazy like me, just apply falsies and that's it. Your eyes are going to look pretty. <laughs> so now I'm just going to apply a very tiny uh, of this eyeshadow that I use for my eyes. This is the taupey color that I told you before. I'm just going to run it uh, on my um, cheekbones just like that because this is going to accentuate that area and my cheekbones are going to look um, very very pretty and contoured and my uh, bone structure is going to stand out. So now I'm just going to uh, finish with a light uh, coverage of a powder. I'm going to be using this rice powder that it's kind of white so this is going to provide me the white pale skin that uh, vampires are famous for. And now it's time to move on to the lip area. Um, as you can see I'm just lining my lips with a black pencil just like that because we want to have like dramatic lips and um, I'm just using this uh, eye pencil for my lip area. Okay, so now I'm going to apply a purple um, lipstick. This one's from NYX and it's very pretty. It's called Pandora and I'm just going to apply it directly from the bottle because I want the lipstick to get mixed in within with uh, the pencil that I just used. Uh, so it's gonna look you know perfect and very very dramatic. So now for a little bit of color we're gonna be applying this very bright and vivid pink uh, lipstick on the center of the lips and actually that's it. As you can see this is a very simple makeup. It's very seductive, very pretty, very romantic. So if you like like if you like <laughs> romantic uh, vampires, I think this is going to be a good look for you. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and see you in a next video.